Yo, what's going on, guys? Jason Trio here with BitTrio.com. Today is Friday, April 5th, 2019. <clears throat> yes, we did it. We made it to Friday. Nobody wants to work today. Had all my tabs closed on me this morning. I don't know what the fuck happened. Let's see if this is even up. It is. On my Brave browser, I had a ton of tabs open, but they closed on me, so I don't know what is going on. I guess it does that sometimes. Okay, good, all right, so we're good with that. So I just opened up whatever I remember. I had a ton, though. I don't know what else is all up here. All right, so we're good. We're up. I don't know, man. What am I doing here? Just talking shit. Playing a game. Stacking my bread. Building my body. Building my mind. Being a better husband. A better father. That's what I'm doing. Just being better. Every day. Every week. Every month. Every year. And then it's over. Then you're fucked. Then you're dead. What are you gonna do, man? Just be nice. Stop being a dick. <laughs> Can we seek an enemy, dude? I have no coffee either. My wife had a doctor's appointment. She's got off on Fridays. She has a doctor's appointment this morning. Damn, no thorns though. No thorns. And, um, yeah, so I don't know. I figured I'd wait for her to get back, you know. That's how that man's do. That's how that man's do. Oh, he's got super sneak anyway, so. Uh, I would like to roll a thorns, but my man's ain't thorns ready. I would like to roll him too, but he's, you know, he's getting funky down there. Does this work? No. Damn, this doesn't work. This is what I want. I want 18. I want 18. All right, we're just gonna do it like this then. Cockatrice in the back. Cerberus in the back. And Hydra, we're gonna see Hydra, I'm sure. Yes, I don't know what I'm doing, man. I'm just fucking uh, living life, man. You know what I was kind of thinking too? I was playing this, uh, the playing this drug wars game right here, and uh, it's somewhat of a, you know, it's not as interactive as a game as you might think. What it is is you're basically like a drug boss, and you uh, you build your shit up. You build an empire of fucking drugs. Weapons and alcohol and shit. You build your shit up like a distillery, a bar, a brewery, a castle, an industrial distillery, you know, a safe. And then, you know, it's like a gangster type shit. But it had me thinking, too. It's like, uh, you know, you try to upgrade a building and it's upgrading, right? It takes an hour, 33 minutes and 10 seconds. It's counting down to upgrade. And you produce... 12,000 drugs a day, 7,000 weapons a day, 3,000 alcohol a day, things like this. And you can upgrade to produce more and daily and daily and daily. You know, so it's like a slow grind type of thing. And it just had me thinking, you know, that's like life, man. That's what life's like. Look at this. Both of us got cocky in the back. Come on, Cerberus. How you miss that dude? 
Dude, the front line has sneak? Hold up. Hold up, bruh. Yo! What the? Oh, no, reflect. All right, I'm bugging out, yo. See what I'm saying? I need some damn coffee. I'm bugging out. I can, like this dude sneaking on me and shit from the front. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Ah. Uh, can we take out this whole squad? I mean, we're going to need some retaliates. Retaliate? Okay. One. Nah. Nah. Yeah. So that's life, man. That's what it is, dude. Like, you, you slowly build. Whether you're, you're going in the right direction or the wrong direction. You're building. You're, you're acquiring. You're accumulating. And you might think you're not doing anything, but you are. You're accumulating shit. You're accumulating negative negativity. When you choose not to do anything and just sit on the couch and drink soda or just don't do anything, you know, that's actually a choice of something. You're doing something. It's weird. It's hard to understand. It's hard for me to understand as well. But it's true, man. It's freaking true. I don't know. What the hell? Probably not, right? For all my boys. And that's kind of like what drug wars is, man. It's like, it's like life, dude. You know, people spend all this time playing these video games and leveling their dudes up and being real meticulous and precise. Like, all right, I'm going to level my drug lord up. I'm going to make him have all these, this empire. And it's going to take time. It's going to take days. It's going to take commitment. It's going to take money, investing. It's going to take all these things. I'm going to have to do it right. You're making mistakes, maybe, you know, you're learning from mistakes. You're doing all these things, you know? And we do that. We do that shit. But in our real life, you know, we're like, man, fuck this, bro. Oh, come on. Come on. We're trampling now. But still. Damn. Oh, the poison. Still going to win this. Oh, the miss. We're still going to win, though. Damn. The miss, though. Slippery. So that's life, you know? I mean, pretend like your life's a fucking video game. Joe Rogan has one of these videos where he says, pretend your life's like a movie. You know, pretend your life's like a movie and you're the fucked up character and your life's gone to shit. And you're at the part in the movie where you're turning your life around and the music's playing. And the shit's about to kick off and you're building. You know, you look at an old picture or something and your daughter and it sparks your life. And you're like, I'm going to get my shit together. You know, like a movie. You know, that's your shit. That's your life. And it could be the same thing with like a video game, man. Look at your life like a video game. It's not as easy to do because in a video game and in a movie, you know, you don't get the gratification. Like I say, you eat the cookie. You don't care if your video game character eats the cookie because you're not going to get the gratification. It's not going to taste good to you. But in real life, you do get the gratification. So, you know, you want to fuck them hoes. You want to fucking smoke that weed. You want to eat that cookie. You know, because you are getting the gratification from it. It's a lot easier to say no to your computer avatar than to yourself. But you just got to get past that. Another thing, too, man, that I didn't put on my list, but I probably should, dude. No jerking off, bro. No beating your meat. Can't do it, man. Can't fucking do it. Can't beat your meat. Now, I'm in a good situation where I don't have to fucking beat my meat, dude. I'm married and shit, you know what I'm saying? I get ass. And, uh... That's it. Fuck. But even still, you know, beating your meat's horrible, dude. It's horrible. You're rewarding yourself for nothing. You didn't earn that shit. And then you get addicted to it. It feels good. You just want to keep doing it and shit get hooked on it. You just want to watch porno and shit and be like, damn. I mean, look at it. Porno is fucking enticing as hell. You got these hot ass bitches getting fucked and they're all willing and shit. They're like extra willing, you know? They're acting. They're extra willing. All they want is dicks. They want dicks across their face. They want to suck dicks. All that shit. They're nasty bitches. They fucking dream. Dream chicks and shit, right? You love these bitches. But we don't love them hoes. You know what I'm saying? They're doing all the freakiest shit imaginable and they're hot as hell. And you're like, damn, these bitches are hot as fuck. 
and you can't control yourself and you're just nutting all over yourself and shit. It's beautiful, it's great. But you can't give in to that shit because number one, that shit's fake, right? That shit's fake as fuck. These bitches are acting, dude. They don't want the dick like that. And if they do, they're these nasty ass hoes that are getting trained by all these dudes and they're all stretched the fuck out anyway. So you need to find your girl, man. You need to find your girl. Don't be out there fucking beating off to these, these fucking chickity chicks. Go find your girl. All right, what are we doing here? Four. One. All right, it's not terrible. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, so that's one of my things, too. No fucking jerking off, dude. I don't jerk off. Fuck that shit. You know, I was caught in that shit for a little while. You know, I'm a fucking guy, man. Everybody be doing that shit, probably. Who knows? Not everybody, but a lot of dudes. But don't do it, man. It's fucking terrible. It's terrible, dude. Because it's so good. It's such a good thing. You know, like I said, the chicks are hot. They're willing. They do all the nastiest shit. You can find any fetish you want. So if you want a girl to be getting face fucked all hard. Or you want to fucking suck toes or some shit. Let me plug this. Plug this laptop in real quick. You know, you can have the nastiest shit. You want to tie a bitch up or something. You know, there's all types of shit out there, man. You got categories and shit. And these bitches are getting paid to do it. So it's not like this is the real life and shit. Yeah, sure, there might be some chicks out there doing this in real life. But it's it's few and far between. And anyway, go find it. You know, if that's what you want, go find it. But, you know, don't do that shit, man. Just don't do it. It's bad for your psyche, man. And there's tons of videos and tons of science behind it where it's bad for your psyche but just think about a common sense you're rewarding yourself with all this pleasure for nothing so you're just gonna get used to all this fucking pleasure man it's terrible hydra in the back though all right we need some retaliates and that's that's it we need some retaliates oh shit so i shouldn't even have played this guy I think I, I think I screwed myself here because, uh, oh, retaliate trample. Okay. Later. Later. Oh, that was Chris Love, too. What up, Chris Love? Later. Yeah, when he gets that retaliate trample on, dude, psh, curtains. Fucking curtains. So that's another thing I'm doing, man. No jerking off. I don't beat my meat. You shouldn't beat your meat either, man. Fuck that shit. Oh, hold up a second. Got this dumbass thing beeping on me and shit. Fuck you beeping for, bruh. So, you know, I'm just on my mission, dude. I'm on my mission to be fucking great, you know? To be the shit. And I don't have to be amazing, but I want to be fucking good. Alright, four. Uh... Turtle? All right, whatever. Sometimes I do this. I put the frosty up in there. Put the heels in the back. And I'm just looking to add things, man. You know, just keep adding things to my life. Things that, uh, things that are good. Just keep adding fucking things, man. And just becoming better and better. I was watching this video of this guy. <clears throat> Forget his name. Small YouTuber. He's got like 6,000 subs or something. Still a lot more than me, but just saying. Um, he he has a daily a morning routine. He gets up every fucking morning at 5 a.m. Meditates for 10 minutes. He does a Wim Hof breathing. Then he gets in fucking ice water. Every fucking day he's got this fucking ice chest. I want to do it too, these, uh, these, these freezers and shit, right? You got these fucking freezers. All right, it's going to be tough, man. He's got the all straight magic squad, dude. Yup, straight blasting, my dudes. Stun is worthless. And it's good for him. All right. Straight ripping me, son. 
Straight ribskies. I need that ruler to seize. Because otherwise, I ain't ruled shit. But it would have been nice to have a magic reflect there. So yeah, just that dude, dude. Imagine what type of fucking animal you are. Or what type of animal you would become if you got up every fucking morning and jumped into a fucking freezer full of fucking ice water. You know how, you know the fucking guts it takes to do that shit, man? The fucking whatever in your fucking head to hold yourself accountable for you to do it. Ain't nobody telling you, Jason, time to get up, time for school. Time to get in your ice bath. No, that's you. You have to make that choice every day to get in that cold shower, to get in that ice water, to not fucking jerk off. Because I know it happens with dudes, man. I'm going to lose this again, too, I think. You see a picture of a chick in a bikini or some shit, dude. Whoop. Brain straight to fucking beat off mode. Oh, shit. That bitch hot, man. I'm about to fucking beat my shit. You know, you're straight in the fucking beat off mode, dude. Right after. As soon as you fucking see that shit, boom. It's time to beat the meat. That's just the way guys are, man. I had something. My shit's going on. My fucking... My other computer's like updating and shit. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Got all these fucking updates and shit. But, dude, that's what it is with guys, man. We're so horny. I don't know. At least I am. I know I am. So I gotta hold myself off of that shit. Like, no. Chill. Chill with all that. Don't be doing that shit. Cause it's bad. It just makes you feel bad too, man. It really does. And I think of it in another way, too. Like, uh, I'm too good for that. This is kind of how I think about it. Like, I'm too good for that, man. Nah, I don't do that. I'm not fucking beating my shit. Yeah, I should have put Pixie in the front. I fucked up. Put Pixie in the back. That was dumb. Like, nah, I don't beat my shit. Shit, fuck that. You gonna fucking suck my shit. Hell no, nah, I ain't beating my shit. You know, so I take it like an attitude like that. And that kind of helps. It seems to help. Damn, we're losing. We're losing. Medusa should be in the back, not in the front. Maybe though, there's a chance. Oh, four speed. Sometimes you get lucky. But it's always a flip of a coin anyway. Like either his four speed's going or my four speed's going. And why not me? So that's the way I think of it, man. Don't beat off, dude. You're better than that. Somebody else needs to jerk your shit off. Not you, shit. Hands off, motherfucker. Hands up, don't shoot. Hands up, don't shoot my dick. Somebody else gonna have to do it. I ain't doing it. Too fucking good for that shit. The way to look at it, man. I mean, that's the way I'm looking at it. You know, you can find your own way, but if you're beating your meat, you need to cut that shit the fuck out right now. Today. Make it today. April 5th, 2019. No more. Not beating your meat. No more, dude. The meat beaters. We gonna beat our meat. Don't do it. You know, it's, it's, it's become accepted in our society. It's like, oh, everybody does it. Everybody does it. You know, like, nah, bitch. Don't everybody do it, man. I don't do it. People don't do it. Your grandpa probably don't do it. He probably has. You know, he's already beat all the nut out of his shit. But still. Is it even worth, you know? Like, is it even worth it with these guys? I don't know. I don't know. 
We're gonna try it though. Or is there another four drop I can run? Or a three and a one? He's kind of useless though with this uh, Inspire, with this build. Uh, it's okay. <clears throat> I don't know. I, I feel like these Minotaur Warriors and these Giant Rocks, man, they're just not as good as I, I thought they would be. I don't know. I see Reach, and I see, okay, you know, they can attack from the back. I don't know. It... it it's something that I like. I like to go into it. It seems like it's value to me. But I'm losing a lot. And they're maxed out. Well, this dude is, but... <clears throat> they've been losing a lot, so I don't know if it's even good. Alright, so he's not running his magic anymore. Come on, bruh! Show me some magic! No magic. Double snipes. And he's fully maxed out. So we're a little worried here. Damn. They're gonna chop my dude to right down. All right, so he's gone. I don't know. Did we win? Hell no. Hell no. Yeah, that's a pretty good team. Selenius guy will all range, dudes. Yeah, my shit's got to restart again, man. My other computer fucking doing all these damn updates. shitty ass music out of here damn tinging on that piano david quinn get something else playing in here What's twitter talking about weasel bass weasel bass he's liking my shit And people do a lot of things like this too, like uh, abstinence, you know? Like, so I'm not jerking off. And you got people that do other stuff, like we don't smoke weed, we don't drink, you know? That's cool too. That's good shit too, man. You know, you could do some shit like that. You could be like straight edge or something. I probably should be. I'm just not doing it because I'm fucking dumb. But I probably should be. That's good too, man. Smoking's bad for you. Drinking's bad for you. I like to mix it up though. You know, I don't want to have myself cut and dry. Like I never smoke. I never drink. You know, I want to have fun. I want to smoke here and there. I want to drink here and there. I just have to try to balance it, which I don't do a great job at because usually when I have weed, I smoke it like a fucking fiend. Same thing with alcohol. If I buy a fucking case, 24 beers, I'll drink every day for the next four days or whatever until the fucking beers are gone. Five days, whatever it takes me. You know, self-control, man, it's a hard thing to do. Uh, but jerking off, I feel like jerking off's a little easier because that's how I look at it. I look at it from that perspective, like, nah, I'm too good. I'm too good to do that. I get the urge, you know, I get the urge, man. Like I said, you see somebody or something, you know, you just go right to it. You just want to go to Pornhub real quick and be like, Oh my God, these bitches are hot. You know, whatever. You know, you get that feeling that you just want to do it. But you just got to fight it, man. Don't do that shit. You're too good for that, is what it is. Maybe I can use that same thing for smoking or drinking. Like, man, I'm too good for that shit. Put that shit in my lungs. Put that shit in my body, man. My body too good for that shit. 
You know, I could think like that too. It could work. It could possibly work. But then where's my outlet, you know? Like with this jerking off, you know, I'm married. So then I can find that outlet. Like, nah, I'm waiting until the wife becomes home. And I'm fucking this shit out of her. You know, shit like that. Then you get in an argument with her or something or she's not in the mood or, you know, something like that happens. You're like, man, fuck, I should have beat off when I had the chance. You know, you get all that shit, man. It's, it's Life's crazy, you know? It's like, it's a wild thing, man. It really is. Damn, we in trouble, man. I think we're in trouble here. Oh, fuck, I'm burned. We go. We go, we go. So I'm here. I'm gonna be here. We're gonna learn. It's all gonna be documented. Whatever. And then that's it. We'll just see where it goes. You know, I got my ideas, I got my ways. I'm open to any suggestions, you know, hopefully I can influence some people to do good, to do better. And you could have some results as well. And let me know and just talk about it and figure out what your shit, how you're doing and shit like that. Because people got different ideas, you know, people got all types of, and it's tough, you know, if you're not fucking, uh, if you don't have nobody, you know, jerking off seems like the easiest thing to do. But you just get stuck in it, dude. It's a habit, you know? You get stuck into that daily thing multiple times a day. You just keep going back and back to the well. Like, ugh. You just get sucked into that shit so much. And then you feel like, shit, you're drained. Like, all your energy's just been zapped out of your dick and shit. Like, ugh. You're not even a man anymore, dude. You just jizzed all over the place. You lost all your fucking hero heroism, whatever. You lost it all. All right, aim. True. We gotta snipe. We gotta sneak. The dudes are running. Life. But see, this is like a Selenia Sky right here. You got three range attacks. You might as well run Selenia Sky instead of running Ulrich. I think they should come out with more dragons, dude. Have dragons be their own splinter. Don't let Selenia Sky pick a splinter like water, fire. Let dragons be its own thing. That's what I think. Come out with some more dragons. Let Dragon, let Selenius Guy be our own little splinter. Oh shit. Romantic. I just think she's too good, man. I bet her win percentage, she's got the best win percentage out of anybody. Oh. Oh shit, that was huge. Now our boy's gonna die. Oh shit. Damn. Damn, we're just getting crapped on today, man. It's Friday, dude. We wanna have fun. We don't wanna lose. We wanna win. But, you know, these games and all this stuff on here, man, it's not as pointed as real life, dude. Real life is that shit. So instead of building up your steam monsters, your drug wars, your sims, your smite, your World of Warcraft, your fucking crypto kitties, 
You know, whatever the fuck you're playing. Build up your life, man. Your real life, dude. That's what's up. That's what's up. Build up your real life, son. That's what it's about. Don't be fooled. Ooh-wee. All right, I'll run it. All right. Um, yeah. I want some coffee. I gotta make some coffee after this, man. And I got some meetings coming up, too. What do we got here? Uh, yeah, I got a meeting in about 30 minutes, so. I gotta prepare. I gotta prepare for my meeting by playing Steam Masters. Y'all ready to talk about business, son? Y'all ready to talk? Let's go. Let me get my Steam Monsters game on. I'm preparing for this meeting. Let me get my notes together. I be rolling up in the meetings like, yeah, what up? Nah, I don't do that. But I should prepare a little more. Instead of doing this Steam Monsters shit, I just be rolling up in there like, yeah. But I do feel, like I've been saying, dude, you know, if you're struggling like uh, with public speaking like me, and you, and you probably won't even think that I am, right? You're like, huh? You sound fine. You sound cool. You sound normal. You sound... Maybe you think I sound like a dick. You know, I don't know. Maybe you think I sound like a retard. But uh, you probably don't think I have social anxiety, right? You know? But I do. And I don't know why I do. And it just came out of nowhere as well. But it sucks. And I don't like it. So I'm trying to fight it. Damn. Come on. Ah! Don't die to the crust. All right. I don't know why all his dudes are hitting. Is this aim true or something? What the fuck? How the fuck all his dudes hit? But yeah, dude, like, uh, I remember Jerry Seinfeld came out and said he had social anxiety and shit. And you would never tell. Like, you know, he's doing all this stand-up and shit. So it's kind of, I'm similar to him, I think, in the way where, uh, you know, we try to be funny. We try to be up and amped and energetic and, like, you know, take the attention off me. Weird way, right? But it seems like you're putting the attention on you. I don't know. I can't really explain it well, but... I do feel like doing these talks and doing these videos every day, it definitely helps me with the public speaking because all I'm doing is I'm sitting here and I'm fucking shouting, I'm talking. So then I get in these meetings and I'm like, damn, I just got done talking for a fucking hour, 30 minutes, whatever the fuck, playing Steam Monsters. And now look, I'm gonna talk to you motherfuckers. So it does help. And they're like, what the fuck? Jason, loud as fuck. People are like, turn the volume down, bro. I be in these meetings screaming and shit. Like, turn the fucking volume down, Jason. Why are you fucking screaming? Or they might like that, you know? Because in, in it's corporate, believe it or not, a lot of people are quiet. You know, you got your people. You got your people. Don't get me wrong. There's a lot of fucking egos. But <clears throat> there's a lot of quiet motherfuckers that don't want to talk, don't want to say shit. And when they do talk, they're not fucking yelling from the rooftops. They're whispering and, they, you know... You know, putting some sort of ha ah! in your voice gives you some sort of something. I don't know. Something. Authority. Something. Gives you something. Some of that good shit. So that's why I be on here doing this shit, man. It helps me. It really does. So I would say, you know, and I was looking this up too, man. I was on YouTube and I was looking shit up. Like public speaking practice. Public speaking help. I'm trying to figure out tips, right? You got all these people giving you tips and shit. It's like, man, shut up. You know, envision this. People in underwear and all this shit. Man, blah, 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 blah. Right? Fuck that. The best advice I can give and anyone can give is just do it. That's it. You want to learn how to do push-ups? Do push-ups. Want to learn how to fucking jump rope? Jump rope. Want to learn how to public speak? Speak in public. That's what it is. Do it. Do it, motherfucker. Do what you're struggling with. That's the fucking secret of life. And there you go. Now, you know. Secret of life, man. And that's what I'm doing. I'm out here doing it. So if you're struggling with it, man, make yourself a fucking 
uh, DTube Steam account. Get on a Steam blockchain. Get on YouTube too, but YouTube, you're really not going to get paid. At least you'll make some dough, man. You get on here, you know, you might make like 10 cents a day or something. You know, whatever. You're making something. It's going to add up. You could play a game like me or you could read a book. You know, people might like that shit, dude. I was thinking about doing that. Reading books like storybooks and shit. Kids books. You could do that. You can read books and shit. Damn, his dudes are just way fat. What? Fuck! Come on! Oh! Alright, man. Just getting dropped this morning, dude. I'm shitting on me here. Five in a row down. I think I'm like two and five this morning. Am I two and five or one and five? Or even worse, one and six, one and seven. I'm one, two and seven. 32 minutes ago, two and eight, two and eight. I'm two and eight this morning. You guys want to talk about Steam Monster strategy? This is the channel. Two and eight. I'll let you know how it goes. We ain't worried about it though. All day. All right, we got 10 to go. And two slots. So we got to do a 5-5 five, five, or an 8-2 or a 7-3. What am I doing? I couldn't even tell you. But we're going for it. We're going for it. So, yeah, start a channel, man. Read a book. Just read a paper, right? Fucking read a page a day to your computer. And it sounds crazy and it sounds weird, but it will, it will actually work, dude. It will actually fucking work. It's working for me. It's crazy. It's fucking crazy, man. It actually works. So it's awesome, dude. You know, you'll do it. If you want to do it, you'll do it. That's pretty much the bottom line in life. If you want to do it, you'll do it. I mean, there you go. Simple as that. If you don't want to do it, yo, here, here's how it goes. Here's how it fucking goes in life. You ready? If you want to do it, you'll find a way to do it. If you don't, come on, we needed that, dude, for trample. If you don't want to do it, you'll find an excuse. And I think that somebody said that shit. But whatever. That's the truth, man. If you want to do it, you'll find a fucking way. If you don't want to do it, you'll find an excuse. So find a way, man. Don't find an excuse. Find a fucking way to do it. And get your fucking shit together. Because you're just going to sit here and you're going to watch me and you're going to fucking be like, God damn, that motherfucker. He did it. It could have been me. And it still can be you, man. It still can be fucking you, man. You know? It still can be. Because you'll just be starting later, that's all. So you might as well start now. You know, the other saying is the best time to start was yesterday. Second best time is today. So do that shit, man. All right, that's going to be it for this Friday. It's Friday. Friday edition of the stream, man. I got a meeting to get to. I got to prepare slightly. Slight pre preparation. So I'm going to get out of here, man. Thank you all for watching the stream. Hope everybody has a great weekend, man. Starting to warm up. Get out there, enjoy the weather. I'll talk to you all on Monday. Later!